Nearly one in four children in Oregon is currently living in poverty. And that's according to a recent study released by the advocacy group Children First for Oregon. Newswatch 12's Casey Kirshner is live in the newsroom to explain what that means for those kids and how it's affecting Southern Oregon. According to Children's First, the 23% of children in poverty in Oregon is above the national average. Although that average is slightly lower than last year, child advocacy organizations say something needs to be done. Court appointed special advocates or CASA works with children in poverty every day. Most of the children um, that we work with come from either that poverty or maybe slightly above poverty uh, income level. And at their office, they're no stranger to what living in poverty conditions can do to child development. The detriment to children is possibly not regular attendance in school, food insecurities, summer comes, where are their resources, are they able to access resources, are they, is their brain development affected. And with nearly one in four kids living in poverty in the state, it's something CASA says shouldn't be ignored. Children learn what they live, so they may not have the tools or the skills to even recognize that how they're living is probably not meeting all of their needs. The poverty line is defined as a household making less than $19,790 annually for a family of three. And Children First says to remember that these aren't just numbers. It's not just a statistic for those kids. It's not just a statistic for our community. It's real families and real children who are making very difficult choices between paying for housing or paying for safe child care. And some families won't ask for help. And there's also a pride issue uh, for some people living in poverty, which is they don't want the handout. When sometimes asking for help is exactly what they need to do. You are not a product of your surroundings, that there's always hope, there's always someone there to lend a helping hand, there's always an advocate who's willing to help. All you have to do is ask. Children First for Oregon says they're reaching out to policymakers to address the problem and the organization hopes officials will help put more opportunities in reach for more Oregon families. Live in the newsroom, Casey Kirshner, Newswatch 12.